Number 38, for the following three vectors, what is 3 times c dot product with 2 times a cross product with b? Vector a is equal to 2 in the i direction, plus 3 in the j direction, minus 4 in the k direction. Vector b is equal to minus 3 in the i direction, plus 4 in the j direction, plus 2 in the k direction. And vector c is equal to 7 in the i direction, minus 8 in the j direction. So let us first calculate it. 3 times vector c, and this is equal to 21 in the j direction, minus 24 in the j direction. So this is vector 3 times c. Now let us do 2 times a. So 2 times a is equal to 4 in the i direction, plus 6 in the j direction, minus 8 in the k direction. Now we have to do is this cross product over here. So 2 times vector a cross vector b is equal to the determinant of this matrix, which the first row is always the same. It is i hat, j hat, and k hat. The second row is the first vector that appears, which is this one over here, 4, 6, and minus 8. And the third row is the second vector, which is vector b, minus 3, 4, and 2. So you have to calculate the determinant of that matrix. And it is, let's see, 12 in the i direction, plus 24 in the j direction, plus 16 in the k direction, plus... Uh, 18 in the k direction what else minus 8 in the j direction and plus 32 in the i direction and this gives us 44 in the i direction plus 16 in the j direction plus 34 in the k direction. So this vector over here is this term, the right term over here. So now we have to do the dot product between 3c and this vector over here. So we're going to do 3c dot 2a cross b, and this is equal to 21j hat minus Sorry, this is not j, this is i. This is i over here, right? 21i. 21i. Minus 24j. Uh, dot product with 44i plus 16j plus 34k. So all you have to do is to multiply the components and then sum everything up. Since you don't have k over here, then you can just forget about this k over there. So this would be 21 times 44 minus 24 times 16. And this gives us, let's see, this gives us uh, 540 and this is the answer of the exercise.